Garish Oberoi elected as the new FHRAI president. Last tenure, I wouldn't say later year, was a very shaky year where liquor banned 500 meters happened. A lot of effort and energy went into that. Most of the hotels and bars which were affected by the ban have now been reopened. There are few bars which are left. There are states like Kerala and, um, and Maharashtra. Hotels have not opened there because of the Gram Panchayat. So we have to still address that issue. One, that is top priority for me. Then there is a priority on the GST also. We have been trying to convince the government don't treat us totally luxury, but we will still keep fighting that. Bring 12% across the board. The centre has announced the development of a new Greenfield Airport in Chennai over the next five years. The airport, which would be the second one for the city. Indian Aviation Academy's new campus inaugurated in Delhi. Now, uh, 110 crore has been put in. The monies have been through BCAS, DGCA and uh, Airport Authority. It has taken about three years to put this facility up. Under one roof, we are virtually providing end-to-end -end, uh, skill uh, solutions, keeping in mind the kind of growth which our aviation sector is undergoing. 20% plus every year. It means we need 20% more manpower every year. Now that's a huge skilling demand which is there, which is unmet. As part of the disinvestment exercise, the centre has decided to exit three ITDC hotels and hand them over to the state governments. 